Beautiful night for hockey. Let's get set to drop the puck. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Cebulski. Let's go. Opening face-off just moments away. Been fired up for this one. The puck is dropped. Let's go. Move! Oh, he got it. all of that against the boards. He wants everybody to know this is going to be a physical game. Into the offensive end now. Puck leaves the zone. They'll be forced to regroup. Puck picked up by Dahlin. Looks to make a play over to Stinger. And he slides it quickly to Johnston. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Passes it over to Gunnarsson. The Thunderbirds look to start the transition game. Cuts into the paint! Oh, misses! You gotta like that he got into a position to shoot the puck. It's a dangerous scoring chance, but he's got to get that on the net. Good heads-up play to knock it away. And he comes up with it. Into the butterfly, slides across to make the save. Slides it diagonally to Stinger. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Oh, spectacular save on the play! Great positioning. Once he makes that first save, he's got to be in position to make the second. Well done. Stinger's got the puck now in his own end. The Thunderbirds will play it from the defensive zone. Looking to set up offensively. He grabs the puck here at the point. Oh, and he stops that one. That was served up with a whole lot of spice. Into the offensive zone. Play whistle dead offside the call. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Still scoreless in this one. Brandon's won it. Puck scooped up by Benitez. Quick feed to Gunnarsson. Moves the puck. And that slides right out to center ice. That's a long way from home to play the puck. Tosses it on to you. And called for the offside. We'll get a face-off. Heiskanen's really good at creating space for himself, even when he's turning on a dime. Guys, his elite edge's zone ability allows him to carry that speed into those turns and open up some lanes for him to maneuver in. Let's see what he does here. Shot! Denies him on the play! Pretty solid stop, and the puck goes into the corner to safety. Picked up along the boards by Heiskanen. The Wheat Kings have it now. Passes it to Yoshi. Good stand-up hit on the play. Takes the bank feed. Sends it out in front. And that doesn't go as it's off a stick. With the blast. He gets a piece of it with a stick. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The game is still scoreless. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Can't make it work. And he takes the dish. The Wheat Kings play it along the boards. Angles it over to you. Here's a shot. Here's a save by Gursky. Getting into the later stages of this period. Still no score in this one. Brandon's won the draw. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. He's got to work hard to find the puck through all the bodies right in front of him. Moves it quickly over to Johnston. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Puck grabbed by Johnston. And that shot goes off the side of the net. 
And the puck stopper steps behind his own net to play the puck along the boards. And that's broken up. Seattle's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Even and the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Here's a chance. Gets in front of it for the block. First period almost in the books here nearing the final six Whoa. seconds. Along the half wall with the puck. Seattle's gained possession along the boards. And he passes it up ahead to Johnston. He'll need more than that to beat him. That concludes period number one. I cannot believe they got one of the all-time great 90s hip-hop acts getting set to play for the fans here this intermission. I can't wait for this. We'll come back with period number two in just a bit. A chance for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. Advantage goalies for the first 20 minutes. Let's see if we get a goal here in the second. Ray, while we have a moment, give me a sense of what you made of that first period. Seattle's frustration would only be that they hadn't capitalized on the chances they generated with all that puck possession. That's the step they want to take in period two. Let's get the call. I hated that, James. As soon as you make this play, you know your next stop is into the penalty box. Brandon's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Hey, here's a power play, and the game is scoreless. What a nice opportunity for them to kick the other team in the shins a little bit, get the lead, and play from in front. Moves it around along the half wall. Into the corner now. Brandon's got a hold of the puck now. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Can't connect on the shot. Denied by Kursky. Goalies love the butterfly. They know they've got a lot of the net covered, so he slides across. Doesn't worry about this shot. Here's a short pass to Gunnarsson. And he lowers the boom there. Gunnarsson's certainly not at 100%. He's just trying to get through the rest of this shift and get back to the bench. Broken up. And the penalty killing unit doing work. Excellent kill as we're both back to even strength. Well, they'll have to regroup after that. The power play doesn't cash in. Opportunity lost for them. Gunnarsson's not anywhere close to 100% as he finishes this shift. He was banged up during it, and he tried to make sure he got to the end of the shift. Seattle's got it, and they're on the attack. Johnson's got it against the boards. And now he moves it to Darlene. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Center team. And that's stopped. Sends it to the middle. Oh, what a chance. And he fanned on the puck. Moves it to the middle. Great defensive heads up play to pick it off. Stinger's lugging the puck. Quick pass to Johnston. Fires it on net. Oh, brings it off the outside of the iron. Wow. Wow. the corner, but clearly not. Whoa, James. I don't know what that sounded like up there, but from here, that sounded like a car crash. Brandon's got control of it now from their own end. Move! Oh, that hurt from here. He didn't take anything out of that hit. He delivered it really as My hard as he could. Goodness. Takes the feed. The Wheat Kings move the puck in the defensive zone. Puts the puck in play cross quarter. And now it's grabbed by Heiskanen. Benitez carries the puck in his own zone. 
The Thunderbirds take it along the wall. Slides the puck down low. Wraps it. Oh, it looked like he had the corner, but he puts it off the side of the net. Gunnarsson's got it along the wing. Seattle's got a hold of it along the wall. Darlene's going to hear it from the crowd for the rest of the night. He caused that er earlier injury to the home team player, and they're not very happy with him. Watch out! Got a little body contact on that play. Takes a shot! Seattle's looking for a little good fortune. They're not going to find it there. Off the post and out again. Gunnarsson's got it through the neutral zone. Center and field! Scores! What a finish on the play! Brandon's offense has come to life here in the second at the perfect time. They needed something good to go for them. And even though they've got the lead, they've not played very well. But you're in the last half of the game. Now you're in front. And he takes the feed. Just slide to the net. Quick pass to Johnston. And now he angles it across to Stinger. Puts it on net. Gets a piece of it and will play on. Quick pass across to Gunnarsson. Oh, the sauce on that pass. Getting a little physical there with that collision. Passes over to Stinger. Quick Don't shot even and bother. a great save. Brandon's got a hold of it against the wall. The Wheat Kings played along the wing. Takes it out of the offensive yeah. zone and back to center. a little breathing room here late in the second. I would say the next couple of minutes before we get to the intermission are really vital. You'd like to go in just in the spot you're in right now. And not much on that one. Brandon's got the puck. Looks to get the puck over to Gunnarsson. Picked up along the wall by Benitez. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Passes the puck over to Johnston. On the backhand! And with just seconds to spare, they get a goal here to close things out. You gotta look at it from both ways. That's a real kick in the pants for the team that gave up the goal. But what a boost of energy for them to score this late in the period. Moments away from the face-off. Let's get back to the action. Well, there you go. Two periods down, one more to go, at least for now, right? Third period, just around the corner. James Sabolski, Ray Ferraro, ready to bring you all the action. Period number three is set to get underway. All right, the puck is dropped on the third and final frame. 40 minutes into this one here, Razor, how do you see things? Seattle's game plan really can't change or shouldn't change too much. They've owned time of possession. They've had the puck a lot. They just haven't been able to catch the game. Brandon's looking to break out of their own end. The Wheat Kings have it behind the net. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Makes a move in front. Move! Oh, to Here's a chance!
What a delivery. I mean, if you can shoot the puck like that, why would you ever deep? What a quick shot. And that's in the net. Brandon's widened the gap to two here with a quick one in the third. Really important that you start this period in the way you finish the last. They were aggressive, they got after it, and now they lead by two. The Thunderbirds gain control of the puck against the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Heiskanen stick handling in his own zone. Feeds the puck across to Yoshi. And he takes the feed. Brandon's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Takes the pass from the left wing. Comes up with a monster save in front. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. Taken by you. Pucks it away in his own end. Takes the feed. Seattle's got the puck behind the net. Stinger's got the puck in his own zone. Return pass. Shot! Makes a save. Scooped up along the wall by Dolly. Center in the front. Oh, and they can't connect on the pass because it was broken up in front. Couldn't make the connection on the play. And he was right there to make the stop on that play. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Moves it to Stinger. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. He's been really good on these high danger chances. And here's another one right from the slot. But he's tracked that puck to keep it in front of him and make the save. Past the halfway mark of this period. Brandon's got a 3-1 lead as they have dominated for the most part in this. Yoshi's won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Brandon's got the puck. Quick feed to Johnston. And that pass doesn't go. And the puck departs the zone. And that's broken up. The Thunderbirds scoop it up along the boards. Seattle's got the puck against the half wall. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the faceoff. Hughes won the draw here in the offensive zone. And he's able to handle that one. Heiskanen's moving the puck through his own zone. The Wheat Kings carry it along the wall. And here's the pass to Johnston. Brandon's got the puck in their own end. One of the best defense is to play some offense as well. This is a smart play. With the lead, he dumps it into the corner. Now he can forecheck a little bit, try to kill some clock. And that goes off a of body. Takes a shot. Seattle's got the puck in the corner. Big time defensive play. Darlene's walking the line. Shot, and it's a one-goal game as he buries it. You want to make this thing believable for yourself. You've got to get away from that two-goal deficit. They've done it here, and now they'll look for the tying goal. Seattle's third-period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Unable to reach that one. Looks to pass it to Johnston. From off the wall and onto a stick. Here he is from the slot. Feeds it down low. A center chance. Shot. Taken along the wall by you. Brandon's got a hold of the puck. Seattle's got possession of the puck. And it goes off the iron. It stays out. The 
defender runs trail in the game, but it's not for lack of effort. There's another one that climbs off the goalpost and stays out. In the final moments of this period, Seattle's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. The Thunderbirds win the faceoff. The Wheat Kings get a hold of the puck along the boards. And there's the save. From the point, looks to make something happen. The Wheat Kings let out a collective groan here on the bench. Beside me is that puck rings off the pipe and stays out. And not much on that one. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. They're coming in waves. Shot. Great save by the goaltender on that one. Here's a pass down low. Takes a shot. Great defensive play to get in front of that one.
Well, this should be an absolute firecracker of a game tonight. Hi, everybody. I'm James Sabalski. Welcome back to EA Sports. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Thunderbirds start with possession as we are now underway. Moves it quickly over to Johnston. The Ice have gained control of the puck along the wall. Takes it to the net. Too much traffic in the lane. Quick feed down low. Winnipeg's got it from behind the net. Can't make the connection on the pass. Here's a short pass to Stinger. Gretzky's taking it from his own end. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Winnipeg's on the attack. Seattle's got control of it now from their own end. Takes the puck at the point. That's using the body on the block. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. James, there's nowhere to go sometimes. You know you're going to get it. You just have to take the hit. The Ice have taken possession along the wall. Pushes it across to Johnston. The Ice have the puck in the defensive zone. On the attack along the boards. And now he moves it quickly to Darlene. Tees it off! Oh, oh, he gets up the body on that. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. From center, they get into the attacking area. There's the whistle as the play was offside. Stinger's a great skater who can turn on a dime, guys. His elite edges zone ability means not only can he turn quickly, but he carries that momentum into a new lane to create more space for himself. Seattle's looking to break out of their own end. Quick pass to Gretzky. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Johnson's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Poked away. The Ice have possession along the boards. Winnipeg's looking to break out. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Slides the puck to Stinger. Moves it to Gretzky. Fails to find the open man. The Thunderbirds will play it in their own end. Slides the puck ahead to Johnston. Passes on over to Gretzky. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. We're still scoreless. Winnipeg's won the draw. And now it's over to Gretzky. The Ice have the puck in the neutral zone. Seattle's got control of it now from their own end. The Thunderbirds looking against the half wall. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. And there we go, icing is the call. Officials are set, players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Hughes won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. Seattle's won the draw and they'll go to work. And he comes up with a huge stop. Seattle's got control of the puck. From the blue line, they take control of it. Seattle's got the puck against the boards. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. We got a penalty coming up here. Whistle stops the play. The Thunderbirds have been handed two for interference. Winnipeg sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Well, to this point, the game is scoreless, and now you've got a real great opportunity with your power play on the ice. 
to get on the board first. That first goal is so critical. Make the opponent chase the game. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Can't make it work. Winnipeg sliding the puck behind the net. Grabbed along the board by Villeneuve. And the puck leaves the zone. The Ice have gained possession off the wall. Oh, what a hit! You can almost see that coming. The defensive player had the lane, and he just runs him over. Johnston's ready to go. And the man advantage unit comes up empty-handed. We keep things deadlocked with both teams back in his way. It's pretty hard to have a more low-intensity power play than that. They really didn't generate a thing, and when you don't generate much, you're sure not going to score. Johnston's very agile on his feet, and his elite edge zone ability is when he turns quickly and carries that speed into his turns to maintain momentum, guys. His smooth skating and turning helps him open up space for himself. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Oh, he cuts up with a stop as he got the glove on it. Passes out front, and that doesn't go as it's off the stick. Gretzky sliding the puck behind the net. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. There's the horn to conclude period number one, and Ray Ferraro's already off to grab his intermission hot dog. We'll be back in just a moment.
Welcome, everybody, along with Ray Ferraro. I'm James Cebulski to this EA Sports Showdown, and we are fired up. Let's drop the puck already. Great energy both inside and outside the arena tonight as we are just moments away now from puck drop. And there's the puck drop. Enough talk. It's time to find out what this is all about. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. This team was ready to play. Sometimes you're just a little over aggressive. And early on, they've taken a penalty. Man advantage unit is set. This has been a pretty tightly played game, but now they've earned the game's first power play. So they've got an opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Start with an offensive zone faceoff and a chance to get out front. Seattle's penalty killers get a hold of it. The ice have the puck against the boards. Receives the pass. And a good solid hit on that play. And that's blocked in traffic. Moves inside! Oh, and another big stop! Moves the puck across to you. Sends a pass over. The Ice have gained control of the puck along the wall. And that's broken up. Johnston's up and ready to join the play. And the PK unit gets their man out of the box. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but... Just all alone! Denies him! No, oh, he's going to be disappointed with that after James the goalie beats him cold. From the left Move. side. Oh, man. Pass. Centering pass! He scores! What a play! As we get another look at this, James, check out the vision and the creativity to thread that pass right through onto the tape, and it's in the back of the net. Winnipeg's up early. Impressed by the way they're playing so far. Really, I am. We talked to their coaches this morning, and they said, like every team, you want to start quickly, but this is about perfect. Poked away at center by you. Puck picked up by Villeneuve. Nice speed at center moves up ahead now. Seattle's got the puck in the defensive end. The Ice have taken possession in their own end. Quick shot! How did he stop wow, that one? Yeah. Sharp reaction save. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Moves the puck over to you. Oh, look at this chance. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Smothered that in close chance. Handles the puck. There's the whistle. We've got it offside. Centers glide into the dot as a face-off ready to resume play. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. There's the whistle icing the call. And sneaks in there on the tie-up and comes up with the puck. Seattle's gained possession along the boards. Tried to move the spot, but that goes off the side of the net. West stop. Yeah. Scores! And it gets right back to him, and he puts it home. I scored a lot of goals like this. I'm telling you, James, once you get in there, you can't turn your back away from the shot. There's the save. You get your own rebound, and you got to put it in. I like it. Got 
Gretzky's won the draw. Puck scooped up by Villeneuve. Nice pass. Gretzky's got it to the side. Seattle's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Winnipeg's looking to break out. And a smart hits up play with the bank. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. Sends it in front. Takes the blast. Scores! Make it! Is this ever going to stop? It looks like they're going to score at will here, James. Dominating and taking control of this game. That's a bullseye. He gets the puck that close to the net. He never misses. What a quick shot. Here in the back half of this period, Winnipeg's got a three-goal lead. Gretzky's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Poked away in the neutral zone by you. Picked up along the boards by Villeneuve. Pass broken up. And we'll reset things after that icing. Use leadership is often by example, not so much with some great speech in the locker room. They need action now. They've got to get back in this game, and the captain's going to have to lead them to it. doesn't miss very often from in here. You get tight to the net, one of the most accurate shooters in the game. The Thunderbirds are still down here, Ray, but not out? Not out, and it's a good thing they found their skates here because this was in danger of being a blowout. Poked away at center by you. Seattle's got the puck along the boards. Slides it up to Stinger. Pushes it across to Vilna. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck. And he takes the pass. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Gretzky. Picked up along the wall by Vilna. Sends the pass down low. Quick feed down low. Moves it to the middle. And that goes off a stick. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. And tries to make a diagonal pass to you. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. There's a firm collision. Dishes it to Stinger. It's only a game. Time when you have to be mad. Look at this. They've got some bodies here on the attack. Yeah, the officials didn't like that. The arms were in the air. Here comes the official's decision. Darlene's going off to the box for two minutes. Face off and another opportunity to take a look at the man advantage unit here. The Thunderbirds get a hold of the puck in their own end. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Look at that hit. Maybe try to wear down the opponents here. Puck grab by Johnston. Circles back to center ice. Right. with that hit. Well, fun start to this one as period number one comes to an end. We've still got lots more still in store. Kids are coming out on the ice here to play the little mini prospects game. And we'll be back in court.
Both teams had a chance to recharge. And the officials set to drop the puck here on period number two. Seattle's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. Takes it into the slot. Decides to think about it. Sends it in front. A blast. And that caroms off a body in traffic. Darlene's up at the box. And the power play unit comes up empty on that one. And nobody's going to be very happy about that one, James. No real chances generated. No momentum game. Just a couple of minutes roll off the clock. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. And he was ready for that one. Darlene's got it in the defensive end. Moves the puck along the half wall. The Thunderbirds scoop it up along the boards. And he makes the easy save. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Winnipeg's got a 3-1 lead. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. Seattle's got it along the wall. Off his stick. Club save and he does it with style. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. Gretzky's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Still lots of time left in the period. It's a 3-1 hockey game. Lots of offense already. Swoops in and grabs the puck with the centers tied up in the scrum on the draw. Oh, and it makes a save. Just got enough to keep it out. Now he slides it up to Gretzky. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Slides it on over to Stinger. Winnipeg's got the puck in the defensive end. Moves it to the offensive zone. Great poke check on the reach. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Trying just a little bit too much there. Foiled on that play. Icing is the call. We'll get a reset. take possession here inside the offensive zone. They'll be back on their heels. They lose the draw after they've iced the puck. They're a little tired. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Winnipeg's looking to break out. Slides the puck over. Quick feed to Gretzky. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. And that was a good heads-up read to make that save. Takes a shot. Turns it aside. Maintains possession. And he regains control of the puck. This is a relentless shift. What great energy as they pour it on. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Past the midway mark in this period. Crowd's been into this one right from the get-go. It's 3-1. The Thunderbirds win it in the defensive zone. Pass across to you. Puck exits the zone. Play is called for offside. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. Gretzky's won the draw. And the puck skips away after a nice defensive deflection. Turns it aside with the glove. Great A chance right in the middle of the ice and the goaltender makes the stop. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Thunderbirds have it against the wall. Can't connect on the pass. Slick feed. 
Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Here's a chance in front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Hughes won a big draw on their own end. Musa quickly over to Darlene. And we'll get a face-off after the offside call. In the final moments of this period, it's a two-goal lead we're looking at with the score 3-1. Hughes won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Winnipeg's regained possession of the puck. The Ice have possession along the boards. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Great glove save! Gretzky's won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Skates to the Whoa. crease. Scores his second of the game. Now here's a little math for you, James. One's good, two's better. He finishes off this opportunity, and now it's a great night. I almost feel sorry for the goalie, James. You know I don't have much sympathy for those guys anyway. Because he stopped most of this. However, he didn't stop all of it, and it's in the net. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. And he easily stops that one. Takes the pass from his goaltender. Bang on passes, center in the neutral zone. Here's a blast! Denies him with a save! Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Gretzky. Sends the pass over. Stoppage in play, offside the call. Winnipeg's won it. Well, this has been a fun one here tonight. Great energy here in the building as well. We'll get a fresh sheet of ice and come back with period number three in moments.
Oh, you can feel the energy in the building here tonight. Hi, everybody, along with Carl and Bade and Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Let's get ready to do this. All part of the team here at EA Sports. Just moments away from puck drop, both teams seem ready to go. Been fired up for this one, the puck is dropped, let's go. Takes a whack but still hangs on. And now it's grabbed by Brady. Back at the point, he set it up. Blocked in traffic. Dismissed that chance. Once he drops into that butterfly, he's pretty confident he's got most of the net covered. He slides across to make the save. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. Oh, he pulled his feet out, James. That's going to be called. It's a tripping penalty. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Gets it out of his own end. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. And now he tries to get it across to Stinger. Sends it down low. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Too much congestion in front. Cappy's got the puck and he's going to hang on. Brady's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. The frozen biscuits dropped and we are back underway here. Great reach by you. Sends it out in front. And that's stopped. Scooped up along the wall by you. Here's a short pass to Savage. And a nice save there as play continues. Inside the offensive zone, takes the pass from along the boards. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Darlene. Prince Albert's PK unit gets their man out of the box. Oh, a good power play is about 20%, James. That one falls in the other 80%. They don't get it done, the power play expires. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Still no score in this one. The Raiders win the draw. Seattle's got control of it now from their own end. From the left side, takes it at center. And that one's denied. Takes the feet at the back end. Quick pass to Savage. Makes the club stop. Cappy's going to cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. We've still got zeros on the board. Takes the pass. Eagle eyes by the referees. Delayed penalty coming up here. Looks like they caught the slash. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. A lot of times a guy will get called for slashing because the stick breaks. When I played, it was wood. You couldn't break that thing if you tried. Prince Albert sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Doesn't matter whether you've had one or ten power plays. The fundamentals of it are the same. Win the draw, puck to the point, try and spread the penalty killers out. Gets it over to Brady. Gains the zone. From the boards, he takes that pass. Seattle's got a hold of it against the wall. Slides it across to Brady. Nice feed. Pass back to the point. Comes up with the steal. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Heads to the back of the net. Savage is ready to join the play. Feeds it on over to Brady. Man advantage fails to deliver and both teams back playing at even strength with the score still tied. That power play was a lot of window dressing. They had the puck in the offensive zone, but really didn't generate a whole lot. The penalty killers must be pretty happy with that. Thunderous collision on the play, and look at the bench set up. Couldn't make the connection on the play. The Raiders have it from their own end. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. There's an injection of energy with that hit. Seattle's moving it along the wing. Prince Albert's got a hold of the puck. Moves it to Brady. 
There's a collision with some authority. Scoops up the puck here. We've got icing on the play. Face-off coming up. Gursky's great in the butterfly position, guys, and even when he's down, he maintains mobility to move with the play to make the save. That's his butterfly effect zone ability. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Feeds it down low. Prince Albert's got a hold of it along the wall. Seattle's in transition. Nice feed from the boards. Goaltender gave up nothing as it hits the outside of the post and will play on. Hey, can we have a bounce so somebody can call a goal here? That shot hits the post and stays out. Flailing at it with his stick to try to get control. Inside the offensive end now down the left. The transition game now into full effect as they move across the blue line. Taken by you. Driving right to the front. Prince Albert's got it along the wall. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Never good timing to take a penalty, but this is not good timing this late in the period. The Raiders send their man advantage unit out once more. Oh, here's another power play, James. They haven't been very good so far tonight. Nothing to show for their previous attempts. So now you have to get back to it, adjust, and re-attack on this man advantage. Grabs control of it at the point. And he makes the save. Prince Albert's got a hold of the puck now. Stopped by the goaltender. The Thunderbirds will play it from the defensive zone. Handles the pass. Moves it to the middle. And that goes off a stick and off target. Moves the puck down low. The Thunderbirds have it now. Seattle's on the attack. Poked away in the neutral zone by Brady. Here's a shot! That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. A clean sheet of ice beckons, and period number two set to get underway. Prince Albert's going to have to work quickly here on this man advantage if they hope to strike. Works it across to Savage. Prince Albert's got the puck along the wall. Quick feed to Brady. Slice it in front. Scores! What a finish on the play! Prince Albers jumped out to a one-goal lead here in the second. Breaking the tie was critical. Now you can play in front and try and dictate the pace of the game. The Raiders get a hold of it. Darlene's lugging the puck. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. Quick feed to Brady. And that pass doesn't go. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Moves it quickly over to Savage. Hangs onto the puck. Gets the puck in deep. The Raiders gain possession along the wall. Reaches out and uses the stick. Scoops up the puck now. Seattle's gained possession along the boards. And that's just out of reach. 
The Thunderbirds move the puck in the defensive zone. Prince Albert's ready to go on the attack. Quick pass over to Savage. Moved up ahead Move. here in the neutral zone. A few moments ago, James, that was a big hit. And we're going to get a face-off after the offside. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. Prince Albert's up one zip. Brady's one possession. Prince Albert's got it in their own zone. Moves the puck. And now he passes up to you. With possession along the wall. He scores! They tie it up! Brand new game. All that work has gone behind this. And we're back to even Steven. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. The Thunderbirds get a hold of the puck off the draw. And the intensity starting to ramp up here after that hit. Here's a short pass to Brady. So close to jumping into the lead. That shot hits the goalpost, and the game will remain tied. Quick pass to Savage. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. good at creating space for himself even when he's turning on a dime guys his elite edges zone ability allows him to carry that speed into those turns and open up some lanes for him to maneuver in let's see what he does here the Raiders take it along the wall unleashes a cannon came up with the same on that play he swallows that puck up as he slides across in the butterfly to make the save Moves it to Savage. Can't make the connection on the pass. Prince Albert's got possession of the puck. We got a whistle offside the call. Past the midway mark of the frame. James and Ray with you tonight. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Centering feed. Contact there. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Here's a shot. Gets the glove on it to make the save. Here in the late goings of the period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Drawing. A nice job locking up his opponent. Cappy's going to bounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's going to take it. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. The Thunderbirds will go to work here in the offensive zone. And sends it just out of reach. Seattle's got it in their own zone. And he takes the dish. Scores! And he puts his team in front. James, this game looks really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. Seattle's got some breathing room here late in the second as they take a one-goal lead. I'd get my best players back on the ice. And while you've got your opponent back up a little bit, try and get another one. Good save! Puck is frozen and we will get a face-off. Has dropped and we are back underway. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Along the half wall with the puck. The Thunderbirds take possession in the defensive end. Can't make it work. Darlene stick handling in his own zone. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Tries to feed it over to Darlene. Slides it to Stinger. And that's broken up. 
He grabs the puck here at the point. That's not going to fool him. Well, two periods down and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. are buzzing, teams are gliding into position here for the start of the third. Here we go, put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Well, it's been a fun one here tonight as the third period is underway. Ray, what did you make of the first two periods? Prince Albert's had such a meager total of shots on goal. Predictably, they haven't scored. They've got to get more pucks to the net. Here's a pass down low. The Thunderbirds get a hold of the puck along the boards. Take it along the wall by you. Oh, what a stop on the play! Positioning's perfect. He gets into the butterfly and makes the save. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. Quick feed to Savage. And makes the routine save. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. It's a 2-1 hockey game. Brady's won it in their own end. Takes a shot. Too many bodies in the way. Denies him. Grabbed along the board by you. Intercepted the pass. Pass broken up. Offside the call. We'll get a reset. Well, they've been under so much pressure here in the defensive zone the last little while. They look like they're totally out of gas. This stoppage comes at the right time. Hughes gained possession inside the neutral zone. Cutting to the slot. Turned aside with a glove. Somehow the shooter got loose in the slot, but the goaltender's equal to the task. That's a good save. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. It's a 2-1 game. Good read by the winger at the two centers time. isn't it? Seattle's won the draw in the neutral zone. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Sends the pass in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Cappy's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. The Raiders have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Brady. Scores! One goal game. Now they've put themselves in a position here to come all the way back. Down two, it looks like a long way to go. Now you're just one shot away. Prince Albert's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Seattle's looking to break out of their own end. The Thunderbirds slide it through center. Drives it to the crease. Up along the wing. Big hit on the play. He's not missed many of these. Every time he gets the puck, they seem to target him. And he's not been able to elude anybody. Oh, and he rocked him. I've been hit like that. You look up, there's nowhere to go, and you've got to take the hit. 
Well, nobody's going to run away and hide now, James. I mean, it's been a terrific night of... Stars had about as much room as a phone booth. I don't even know if they make those anymore, but what a call. I don't think they do, James, but he's in close quarters. He has no room really to maneuver, but he does not miss very often from there. That's a great shot. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. The Thunderbirds played along the wing. The Raiders gain control of the puck. Centering key! A blast! Here's a short pass to Stinger. To the most long. The Thunderbirds are still level, and they've had virtually no luck. That sounds like a clanging iron down there. Strong defensive effort. The Thunderbirds scoop it up along the board. Keep your head up, kid. Solid hit on the play. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Slides it diagonally to Stinger. Takes the feed. A chance! Turns it aside with the glove. Cappy's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed the cover there. A critical draw here. Prince Albert's got it in the defensive zone. Trying to get back on the attack now. Seattle's got the puck along the wall. Here's a shot, and that goes off a player. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. And that puck leaves the zone. Here we go, puck's in deep. Seattle's got the puck in their own end. Here's a chance! Stops him with a glove! Cappy's gonna smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Seattle's got it and they're on the attack. Plays the puck up ahead. Cuts to the paint. Picked up along the boards by Darlene. Can't find his man. Less than a minute to go now here in regulation. Slides it back to the blue line. Seattle's got the puck against the boards. Quick pass to Darlene. Brady's got the puck in his own zone. Couldn't make the connection on the play. And he takes the feed. And that's off target as it hits a body. Seattle's moving the puck through center ice. Skates in behind the cage. Prince Albert's got the puck along the boards. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Darlene's taking it from his own end. Uses the boards with the bank pass. Great heads up play with the stick by Brady. There's the horn, and regulation concludes. We are off to overtime. Both teams will get set to drop the puck and try to pick a winner next. And we are just moments away from overtime. Overtime action is underway. Absolutely love it. Great defensive play at center by Brady. Chance to win it. They score! They take it in overtime! Man, that was...
was a fun one, and I'll say this, the right team won.